Welcome to New Sphere Business. My name is Ronald Hughes, and today I'm going to take a little slightly different approach with uh, a piece on how to train and coach a salesperson. Now, first and foremost, the, the issue is when it comes to training a salesperson, understand first that it's a set of structured pieces of information that a salesperson needs to achieve in a given set of time in order for them to achieve the things that you're looking for as a salesperson. They need to know why, how, and do. Why, uh, you need to explain to a salesperson all the things that they'll be doing, why they have to do them. What's the purpose of those things? What, what, what do they get out of it? Who, what does the customer get out of it? A salesperson needs to understand all of those things or they're not going to take it on board. How to is a demonstration of the steps and stages of the sales process. And finally, doing is rehearsal. It's uh, role playing. Yeah. The biggest problem for most salespeople is the fact that they seldom get trained and almost never get coached. And because of that, never trained, never coached, and you know, poor performance is endemic. And they don't know that they're not doing well. You can only know that you're doing well if you've gone through all the stages of learning. First off, you're unconsciously incompetent when you start out. And you don't know anything and you don't know what you need to know. You become consciously incompetent through training. <laughs> Wonderful thing, yeah? Consciously incompetent. We learn that we don't know everything. You become consciously competent through learning all of the things that you need to cover and then practicing those. And then eventually we become unconsciously competent, which is understanding that we're doing everything right and not having to worry about it and being able to flow with the conversation. It becomes very natural for a salesperson to have a communication which is about questioning, identifying needs, presenting features and benefits, handling objections and closing. And there's no big problems there. But here's where we're going to start. Go back, yeah? You need to decide everything that you need to know as a salesperson and cover all of that. I went through the basics, the fundamentals, a number of years ago and determined that it takes about four days to learn the fundamentals of sales with a lot of high intensity uh, training. It takes another day yeah, to get the fundamentals of action, how to. Uh, doing, uh, practice down, yeah? and then before you can ever send someone well. If you're spending half a day with somebody before you throw them in the field in the first place, then fuck it. You know, it ain't going to happen for you anyhow. You haven't got the worthwhile position uh, to make it uh, of any use to anybody, so walk away from it or don't even pay any attention to anybody else anyhow from now on. But, you know, that, that's, that's the best I can tell you. Look, I hope that's of use to you. And if not, I look forward to talking to you again in the future. My name is Ronald Hughes, and this has been New Spirit Business. Thanks. Bye now.